really did not see that during that first preseason game because it was just they were just overmatched. Option right here for Jimenez. And another goal, a carbon copy of the first, and it's 2 nothing. I see some better finishing there from the Blues, just not sharp enough. Once again, most of the Blues' attacks have come down the flanks just like that, and it's 4-2 to two as the Blues have half the deficit in the second and fourth minute. So over to play this ball in will be Hernandez. Hernandez swings this one near that back post. Langley is there. Langley heads it back in towards the goal. Flicked all the way across. And what a beautiful finish by Torre. That's, that's absolutely just poor marking in the back, Chad. There's oh, yeah. So I know they typically don't give two assists, but it's going to be Torre from Jordan and Langley. Ribeiro, Ribeiro sends it ahead now. Ahead for Ribeiro again, trying to get there. Langley and Ribeiro. Ribeiro inside the 18. Quickly across for Torre, and it's 3-0. You see Ribeiro working down inside Torre, getting wide. All he's got to do is open the foot and put it on goal. So over the ball is Pelletier. And I can't see who, the number on that. Pelletier is going to leave it. There's a strike, and what a beautiful finish. Effortless, it almost seemed like, doesn't it, Larry? Beautiful strike. Uh, stroke. Starting to mount there on the Wilmington bench on the field as well. You can tell they're getting the opportunities, but here comes a speedy Rochester push. There's a shot on net, and that, and that is a goal right there for Rochester. We'll kick it's a good ball, ball. back and it's forth. A good ball here. They in, they're in again. Yep. Here's Robinson. He's dangerous on the left side. Robinson making a run. Into the corner, Robinson with a strong cross. Ooh, it's up in the air. Opportunity. And the finish as the kickers go on top, two to nothing. Well called there. And here's Antigua on the attack. And here's an opportunity. There's a shot. Ooh, and a goal. Nice. Go into with a two goal advantage. Robinson flicked on, and, and a goal! And Gwenya again. And Gwenya with the hat trick. Boy, he has been on fire. That ball has been. Ball played on the right side. Robinson again. Yep. Nate Robinson making a run to the end line. Cross. Had oh, it in. Wow. Goal! <laughs> Nate Robinson has been great at dishing off those beautiful crosses. And I believe it's Vercoloni that finished it off. Words up a little bit. Push, put a little bit of pressure on that back line. And we saw it right there, Wilmington just doing enough to offset the back line and almost came through with a goal. Here's Kelly getting past Evans. Oh! Now Charleston with possession, midway up inside the battery half on the far side. Patterson screaming for the ball. Now he'll be chipped forward oh, and he's, he's on side. Uh, Wilmington has stepped up. It's Patterson into the box. The strike! Oh! And the goal! And Charleston are 2-0 up. It was a good goal from Patterson. Well for him, for the Wilmington Hammerheads. Gets the start tonight as uh, the ball is played forward. That's not offside. It's Patterson. His shot is blocked away. Prince with a goal! Oh, what a lovely finish from the College of Charleston man. Tucked his foot around the ball and uh, curls it into the far corner. It's 3-0 to the battery. And right now, it seems to be going from defense right to the forwards and the attackers up up top. And there's not a lot of fluidity and not coming from the Wilmington side. Here comes Wilson stepping inside. Oh, John Wilson on the right foot. Bends it into the top right corner. And Charleston have taken a four-goal lead. Gets it onto the loose ball first. And uh, perhaps a crossing chance from the far side. It slipped into the gap for Greg. He gets it wide. And now the uh, cross comes in. Oh, it's in. Lovely finish. It was number four, Paul Nicholson, who turned it home from inside six. To get it clear here. Here's Taylor having a go at Wiltsy. Shrugs off the uh, defender. Keeps oh. it in play. Plays it forward here. Good ball. Perry allowed to turn onto his right foot. Now he holds up at the edge of the 18, gets it wide. There's an overlap on the far side, but Prince manages to get back goal side. Oh, there's oh, a deflective finish, it? and it's 4-2 as that shot comes Position in. Position puts it to Taylor Lord making another run, and Dayton playing that triangle style of the Dutch Great Lions. Ball. Beautiful ball to back post. Strike on, and a goal from the Dutch Lions! 
Beautiful play. Offensive position. No one home there. Beautiful play in the box. Oh, it's in the and a shot and a goal, so an opportunity. Phoenix caught napping. Oh, he hits the fences. Nowhere near the goal. Opportunity here. Dayton with the run. Misplayed by Phoenix. Looking to put the wow, ball through. Beautifully ball. so. And sent home. Wow. Dayton again counterattacks. Beautiful ball. Phoenix not able to get back. In the coffin where Phoenix is not crawling out of it. But opportunity here for Phoenix. Looking to see. On a counter strike, looks to put it on, and they wow. do. Maybe I spoke too soon. So Phoenix and kind of keeping the catching the Dutch.